Hi, I'm Pastor Paul Marzon, the founding pastor here at Crossroads Church. And today we're going to be talking about the M word, money. Ooh. <laughs> For many people, you don't talk about politics and you don't talk about money, right? Well, we want to demythologize that whole conversation about money. And in fact, we really prefer the word stewardship which is the biblical term for saying you're given something, money or resources, and God has called us to steward them. In other words, take care of them. Money is just one aspect of that. And so we talk about practicing responsible stewardship. And so if you turn to that section on road marker number six in your team membership um, or team partnership manual, excuse me, you'll see M is for money. And it begins to talk about some of the financial cornerstones of resources and how we're given certain things. We're being blessed by actually work is a blessing. It allows us to get out. It allows us to be fruitful and uh, to fulfill God's purposes for our life. And so we talk about how work also allows us to have resources to take care of. And as we look at that, we talk about things like savings. How do you put aside things? How do you pay off debt or deal with um, credit? And how do you work through some of those things? How do you put together a budget? In fact, we include one in your membership um, team partnership manual, that whole understanding of a budget or a spending plan. And so we give you an opportunity to fill one of those out and have a discussion around it. And so you'll find several resources for that. Likewise, we have a class in church called Financial Peace. And you can take that class. And it's another way that Financial Peace University, through Dave Ramsey, an experience that you go through and begin to understand budgeting and overcoming debt and those kinds of problems. So likewise, we have a whole of this conversation about giving. The biblical model of giving is mentioned there about the tithe that is a 10% gift back to the church. But it also talks about giving generously and not under compulsion. So it's that whole conversation that you look at scriptures and maybe talk to other believers about what is it that I give back to the church? How am I responsible to, to bless the church and, and connect in such a way that we can help others? So this conversation on, on money is one I hope will be something that will inspire you to think and reflect and look at how God has given you and blessed you with so many things, but also how can you ter- in turn give back to God and bless others? So in the end, you'll have kind of a little section that you fill out. So maybe a little bit of homework for this one to fill out your spending plan and do some conversations if you're married or with others that you may do some of your spending with and have that conversation that you can come back and share with the class, of course, in a confidential way and in a way that helps bless you. Let us pray. Gracious and loving God, as we have this conversation this day around money and about financial stewardship, Lord, I just pray a special blessing and enlightenment for people. For some, this is like something they do all the time. They have things on spreadsheets and QuickBooks and um, apps that they use regularly and, and money's not a big deal to them. For others, there may be people listening to this tape for the first time. They're like, wow, I really have a trouble with money. I, I have a huge amount of debt or I'm, I'm struggling with uh, addictions around spending. Wherever someone is, Lord, I just pray this day that you'd watch over them. And I pray, Lord, that you would give them a sense of your direction. I, I pray, Lord, that you would help them to be good stewards of the money and the resources you've given them. And help them this day, Lord, to to be able to have holy conversations to help one another in the body of Christ. I pray for this in your name. Amen.